Kathy is going to be missing out on a once in a lifetime opportunity with you, with somebody like you, with somebody as abundant and loving and like protected as you. I'm showing that the relationship that you've been pouring your energy into is kind of like a fantasy and it isn't necessarily leading to anywhere. Maybe they have friend zoned you. Maybe they've already kind of put you in a specific category that isn't leading towards a long-term higher commitment. We're seeing them viewing you as like good times. You make them laugh. They like having fun with you. They definitely like, you know, doing other stuff with you. If you guys are partying too, like they definitely like to party or, or have fun, you know, whatever that means to you. But this is showing that it's time to grow and transform out of this energy and invest your energy perhaps into abundance and definitely changing habits. This is coming up. This card fell out twice, one, one, one in your pre-shuffle, like changing your habits and your values. I think it's a time for you to focus on manifesting money. Spirit definitely wants you to be grateful for this connection. Be grateful for everything that you've learned so far and everything that you're about to learn because it's showing here that you're going to be completing a karmic cycle with this person. But the way to actually complete the cycle is to change your perspective. And the way you change your perspective is to learn the lesson. And the way you learn the lesson is to actually like face your shadow, face your triggers. And you'll know what your triggers are based on like, what comes up? What do I feel sad about? What do I miss about them? What do I want about them? And really like also writing down what you actually want out of your perfect relationship. If you could create your own reality and you can, what does your perfect relationship look like? And see if this person could give you that. I'm gonna say it's a no. We have third party coming out here. There were other things that got in the way of us being together. I'm getting the vibe that this person like, like kind of likes to party. Oh. Either they stay up all night, they drink all night. You guys may even could live at a long distance. So they're not even really down to like drive, but I don't see them pouring as much energy in this as you are. And this may be your time to finally walk away and get the closure that you need. And even if you can't get the closure from them, that journaling and that energetic pur purging and emotional purging, like crying this shit out and seeing it for what it really is will definitely help you get that closure.